hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is jennifer in this video we'll be preparing some pepper soup and agidi or echo um, the ingredients will be assorted meat crayfish stock cubes onion um, some spices for pepper soup and fresh pepper and um, you, you would also need some salt so in a pot you're going to add the assorted meats and all the and all other spices and please do not forget to like and subscribe to my channel thank you you just need to add all the ingredients Um, after that, you just need to stir, um, stir the pot, uh, the meat, and add some water. So I had to like rinse my blender. You leave it to cook for some time. Here, I came back to check on it, and it's boiling, and it's brought out some juice, like some more water from the um, meat. So now I had to top up the water, like for cooking the meat for the pepper soup. After that, you have to test for seasoning and um, adjust to adjust seasoning to your taste. Like you might want to add some more salt or pepper, and then you cover it and allow it to cook. While that is cooking, um, we'll be making agidi <laughs> here. So we'll be using some corn flour so you have to measure out a cup of corn flour and about um 800 mils of water since we don't have access to like um, for, um dried corn or like back home when making a it takes a whole process like from getting the corn itself like the seeds and cooking it grinding it taking it to the engine to grind it bringing it back so just take a whole lot process so now you have to add the water to the flour and you have to keep mixing till it's very light as if you're making pap Pap or akam. So now, after the mixing, you need to put it on the stove. For it to cook and you have to keep stirring going up as a child um, I remember my mom, she usually makes a giddy, ah, like um, getting from going to the market to buy the corn, um, cooking it, then taking it to the engine to grind, bringing it back home, we have to sift it with um, cheese cloth, and um, after that we have to um, put it on the fire for it to cook and you have to keep on stirring and stirring and stirring 
uh, the favorite part of this um, adiki when it's when uh, my mom finished making it is like you know the under ah the under is very very nice like after she has finished pouring it on the tray and the under like we literally struggle for the under for the like we call it bonbon <laughs> so we literally struggle for that under is very nice and sweet so back to the video we need to keep staring and staring till it gets to a consistency and um we don't want it to have lumps so that's why we have to keep staring don't worry we'll soon be there you can see it has start forming like the lumps have start like um not the lumps it's, it has start coming together And again, another thing in this agidi that we usually struggle, you know, in the agidi, when you pour it in the tray, like when you make it, when it's cooled, when it cools down, like it literally has a skin that you take off. Back to the video, we need to like add some water. And cover it, allow it to for some time here i didn't have this uh, particular sauce but do not have a cover so i had to improvise i had to use like a foil to cover it so back to the story that was say <laughs> that was telling yeah uh, um just telling you guys like you know like the agidi back home when they have poured it in the tray and it's cooled down and you want to serve it like you can't cut it directly because there is a skin on top of it so you need to take off that skin before cutting into the agidi ah that skin is sweet too so now after some time i had to open it up and stir the agidi now you <laughs> can see the consistency so now we have to do the test to know if it's ready so you need to put a bowl you need to put the water in a bowl then scoop out some in a spoon and dip it into the cold water if it comes up then you know that the agit is ready so which it did i don't know why it didn't show very well in this video but basically that's how to test if the agit is ready that's how you know if it's ready so i have some little um plates so i'm going to pour the agit into the plates and let it cool down So there it is. We check. We went back to check on the pepper soup, and um, the pepper soup is ready. Like it's ready. Had to stir and taste it if it was okay. And everything was good, so we had to serve the pepper soup and add the tea. Yeah.